ghosts and skeletons once used to live in harmony. In that community, there was a ghost girl by the name of Buette. Then she sees a very handsome spooky skeleton. This was the skeleton she has always had a crush on ever since the spooking school. She walks up to the skeleton but a female dude was right next to him. The female human hugged the skeleton and she whispered to him. You must have had a lot of calcium because your bones have gotten a lot harder and larger. Buette becomes angry. So she devised a plan to spook the human female. Next day, she becomes invisible and possessed the body of the human person and got her to commit suicide. She then called upon her favorite succubus, Satania, to bring her soul to the deepest parts of hell. Buet took out the bones that she has collected over the years and sprinkled them over the body. The next day, there was court session. I hereby declare the defendant guilty. <laughs> The skeletons got pissed and the ghosts became happy. War was upon them. The kingdom split into two factions, one of the ghosts and one of the skeletons. Buet became military dictator of the ghost faction and Sans became president of the spooky kingdom. You are all mine now. I will murder your entire family so you'll want to create a family with me. Spooky senpai. Everything I do is for us. I hope you understand. <laughs> Our coasts have been raided. So make them water boats leak. Calcium supply should arrive soon. I am ready to be milked. It's a trap! Are the noobs ready? Yes. The portal and missiles have been completed. <laughs> Finally, we get some time alone. All of our people are dead now so the only reasonable thing to do left is repopulate. Buet has finally claimed the prize. She inserted his bone into her beautiful reproductive organ. She got so excited that she hopped as fast as a jackhammer. She squirted out her ghostly acid then whispered to the spooker. I hope you wouldn't mind if we used the other hole. She tried inserting his bone into the exit hole of her digestive system. It's simply too big to fit. She began snapping his bones in half, one by one. Finger by finger, she attached a bone machine gun to the skeleton. She hopped on the machine gun and right when she was about to come a second time, she pulled the trigger of the machine gun shooting off the tiny bone chart stimulating the spookiest of ejaculations. Thank you for bestowing upon to me this spooky gift of yours.